What is an extruder and what do they do? This is a question that's been asked by Max from Leeds. A simple summary would be that an extruder is a processing machine that can convert raw materials into a finished product state. There's a variety of extruders, big variety, so twin screw, single screw, thermoplastic, silicon, etc. I think this question's come in because it's seen on some of our videos, and most of our videos are showing thermoplastic single screw extrusion. So that's the one that we're going to focus on today, and we're going to explain a few technical details about that extruder. So getting into a little bit of the technical detail, when extruding PVC, Usually PVC granules are fed into a hopper and then a colorant's added if it's needed. The hopper then feeds into a barrel and a screw moves the PVC granules along this barrel to the head of the extruder. As you move down the barrel, there are heating and cooling zones and this regulates the temperature along the barrel's length. And the screw plays a key part in this extrusion process. Not only does it move material along the barrel, it also works the material into a homogeneous molten state. So we're going to look at an extrusion screw and we're going to pan down the screw. There's three main zones to an extrusion screw. So there is a feed section, which feeds the material into the barrel. And then there's a compression section, which works the material. And then there's a metering section at the end, which translates that material out of the barrel and onto the finished cable into the extrusion head. There are many other technical aspects such as compression ratios, flight designs, flight depths, and manufacturers have different designs to process different materials. Far too much detail to cover in a short video, but hopefully Max that gives you a brief explanation of what an extruder is. The extruder head is also a key part and the tooling inside that head. So we've brought some tooling here so we can show you different pieces of how that works and we'll explain how that process happens as it comes out of the extruder barrel to get onto the cable itself. We have the PVC in a state that we can extrude as a finished product and we put the PVC through screens to remove any contaminant, through a breaker plate and then a distributor to pass this material onto whatever we are covering. A point is used to hold what we are covering and a die forms the final shape that we want the material to be. We have hundreds of points and dies to manufacture the wide range of cables that we make in our site in Doncaster. So we have different dies and screws for our Fireshore products, Twin and Earth, PVC armlets, Ordinary Flex, Arctic Flex, Meter Tails, LSF versions of all those, etc, etc. We hope this answers your question, Max, and if anyone else has any further questions, please get in touch, contact us, and we'll try and answer them as well.